Welcome back. Please share, subscribe, and comment. France, Barca title. The heartbeat of Barca. A journey through France in the vibrant streets of Paris, where history and modernity danced gracefully together. A young woman named Amélie found herself in a peculiar predicament. A passionate soccer fan and an aspiring journalist, she was determined to uncover the secret behind an increasing number of French fans who were fervently dedicating themselves to FC Barcelona, the iconic Catalan club. One rainy afternoon, armed with her notebook and an insatiable curiosity, Amélie embarked on a mission to understand this fervent devotion. Her first stop was Le Café de Sports, a bustling establishment teeming with energy, where the walls were adorned with memorabilia of both French and Spanish teams. As she entered, the smell of freshly brewed espresso mingled with the sound of animated conversations about the latest matches. Emmanuel, another victory for Barca, exclaimed a middle-aged man, his face luminous with joy as he clinked glasses with his friends. Amelie approached their table, her heart racing at the opportunity to gather insights. Excuse me, she interrupted. Why do you think so many French people are becoming fans of Barcelona? Emmanuel, a devoted supporter in a vintage Barca jersey, leaned back in his chair, a reflective expression crossing his face. You see, it's not just about the game, he began, illuminating the room with his passionate words. Barcelona embodies a philosophy, La Mesia, the youth academy. It's about nurturing talent and playing beautiful, attacking football. It resonates with us, those of us who admire creativity and artistry on the pitch. Intrigued, Amelie jotted down notes, her mind racing with thoughts. She decided that she needed to delve deeper. The next day, she visited a small soccer training academy in Lyon, where children of various backgrounds practiced their dribbling and passing skills. There, she met Luke, a promising young player sporting a Paula's Barcelona jersey. His eyes sparkled with admiration. Luke, what inspires you about Barcelona? She asked. They play from the heart, he exclaimed, enthusiasm radiating from him. I love Messi and how he makes magic happen. I want to be like him one day. It was clear that the influence of Barcelona was reaching far beyond the borders of Spain, igniting dreams and aspirations among the youth of France. Amélie's investigation led her to the stunning countryside of Provence where she met Isabel, an artist who often painted scenes inspired by the glory of soccer. Over a glass of local wine, they delved into a discussion about the culture of soccer in France, comparing it with the fervent passion scene in Barcelona. Soccer in France has its roots deep in our history, Isabel explained, her voice filled with pride. But Barcelona represents a different kind of passion, a unity in its community. The rivalry with Real Madrid, it teaches loyalty while the beauty of its style shows that the game can be so much. More than just winning. Amelie wrapped up her conversations and felt a bubbling excitement in her heart. As she walked along the banks of the Seine, she pondered how she could weave together the myriad threads of her discoveries. The love for FC Barcelona in France was not merely a fad. It spoke to a collective appreciation for artistry, creativity, and a shared sense of belonging that transcended borders. Her article became a mosaic of voices, Emmanuel's loyalty, Luke's dreams, Isabel's artistic vision. The piece resonated deeply, garnering reactions from readers who identified with the character of not just a club, but a movement. They shared stories of how they found camaraderie with fellow fans, forged friendships over shared experiences, and celebrated the beautiful game together. As the sun dipped beneath the horizon, Casting a golden hue over the Seine, Amelie realized that her quest was more than uncovering an obsession. It was about understanding the human spirit. FC Barcelona had become a canvas upon which the people of France painted their hopes, dreams, and passions. A beautiful illustration of the universal language of soccer. And so, in the heart of Paris, a new kind of legacy continued to thrive, binding hearts together across miles with woven threads of admiration for the game, transcending nationality, culture, and time.